Hey guys, Tammy here from ReikiAndYoga.com. Let's talk meditation. So many people come to me in classes every week and they say, you know what, I just cannot meditate. I can't keep my mind quiet. It's just not working for me. I have far too many thoughts going around and around in my mind. And all of those thought forms are going out into the universe, spinning around and around and around in thought, circling your mind, never ending process, almost as if you're crazy. In fact, you just might be crazy. Seriously though, we really do have this whole misconception about how the mind works. If you find somebody walking down the street talking to themselves, you would probably look at them and think that that person is nuts because they're talking to themselves. Although maybe not in today's day and age because they might just have an earbud in and they might be on a cell phone. However, there's a good chance that they don't. So we look at those, pers those people rather and we automatically judge that that person is insane. But if we were to stop and look at how our own mind works and if we were to share, if someone else could get in our head and actually see what those thoughts are that are spinning around and around and around, chances are that person would think that we're insane too. So the process of meditation is something that we can use in order to bring our minds down a little bit so that we're not spinning around in that constant thought that for the majority of time is pretty much unproductive. So what is a process of meditation you can use? I'd like to share with you something that Rod Stryker taught me a few years ago at the yoga show in Toronto. So basically I won't go through the whole process but it's mental alternate nostril breathing. So what you do is first of all, get your body to fully relax. So you can be sitting down or you can lie down on the floor. You don't have to get into a lotus position or anything weird. You just wanna make sure that your spine is long and straight. So once you have a straight spine, begin to progressively relax your body. So start at the top of the head and just feel all of the tension draining away from the top of the head and eventually exiting out the feet. And if you continue to scan your body and continue to relax from the top down, you'll end up having a tingling sensation at the soles of the feet. And once you've achieved that, now you know that you're directing the relaxation process in your body. Now after that, all we do is bring your focus to the nostril point. Inhale and imagine that you're only breathing in through your right nostril. And then exhale and imagine you're only exit exhaling through the left nostril. Then inhale only through the left nostril and exhale only through your right nostril. Now, as opposed to doing alternate nostril breathing where you physically press the nostrils, with this, you're only using your mind. So inhale, visualize it, the breath only entering through your right nostril. Let it swirl up at that third eye point and then exit through the left side. Inhale through the left side, let it swirl up on the forehead and watch as it exits out the right side. It's a really great technique that you can use that will bring you into meditation quite deeply. And in fact, you may even feel like you're meditating as deep as a Buddhist monk. It's possible, give it a try. Hop over to reikiandyoga.com. There's a meditation course that's free you can sign up for if that's of interest. Subscribe to this channel or leave a comment. I'd love to hear what you think. Have a fantastic day. We'll talk to you soon.